like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Well, if normal humans were given the power to make animal hybrids, the results would have been hilarious. Like, some of these imaginative hybrids would have been a reality. But since this hybriding thing is purely a prerogative of scientists, they've created hybrids that are so unbelievable to believe. I mean, just take a look at this video of ligers, zebroids, growler bears, and whatnot, and wonder how far science has come. Number 10. Liger I find it a good omen to kickstart my videos with big cats. They're cool, people like them, and it's interesting to talk about them. Now, coming back to ligers, as the name is suggestive of its parenthood, it's a hybrid between a male lion and a female tiger. They are usually larger and heavier than either of the parent species. The largest of these unique hybrid cats can grow to lengths of more than 10 feet and weigh up to a whopping 2,000 pounds. Some cases have been reported where the ligers weighed more than 2,200 pounds. Although the liger has parents in the same genus, they are from different species, so their mating is against the natural order of reproduction. Therefore, ligers are born sterile and cannot reproduce. When a liger is born, its line ends with itself, and this is the reason for them being so rare. Number 9. Zorse or Zebroids Well, they are the result of two beautiful and gorgeous animals, a horse and a zebra. The Zorse or Zebroids, or whatever you call them, can adopt the genes of both parents varyingly. Some of them can be completely striped like a zebra, some can be half-striped, and still, some of them can have a skin either blotchy or spotty like a horse. Therefore, it is hard to predict what they may look like as they grow older, because this skin keeps changing until they grow old. Even their personality traits and sociability keeps varying and is quite unpredictable, because one parent, which is a horse, is a tamed animal, and the other, which is a zebra, is a wild one. So, the Zorus will either be very friendly, or stubborn, or aggressive, depending on which parent's genes it would adopt. Number 8. Tigons Another big cat hybrid, a cross between a male tiger and a female lion, happened many times in captivity. As both parents are from the same genus, they have no problem in mating and reproducing baby tigons, but as they're a different species, their mating is against the natural order of reproduction, and the tigons, therefore, are sterile. It's the end of the line when a tigon is born, and like ligers, this is why they're so rare. Tigons get their dad's stripes and get their mom's mate if it's a male tigon. Not many people are aware of the fact that lions have spots on their skin, and in the case of tigons, the spots are really visible. The tigon does not grow as much as a tiger because it gets the growth inhibitory genes from its mother and therefore weighs only around 400 pounds. Number 7. Dizo well, some concerned people, and by concerned people I mean some scientists, wanted to improve the meat and milk production of yak and domestic cattle, so they decided to make a hybrid of both animals, and we got the Dizo as a result. It's a huge bovidae, and it's the best of both parents. It was first developed in Tibet, and now both yaks and Dizos are frequently seen on the pastures in the mountains of Tibet and Mongolia. Dizo is a strong and productive animal, both in terms of meat and milk production, and doesn't even increase farming expenses. They can reach up to 5.5 feet in height and weigh up to 1,300 pounds, whereas males are larger than females. Their bodies are covered with long, shaggy coats in the shades of white, brown, and black. They have a cattle-like face with large horns and a large, sturdy body with a hump on the back like a yak. Male Dizo is sterile, while the female, that's called a Dizomo, is fertile and therefore used for the production of new generations of Dizo by mating with purebred yak or cattle. Number 6. Killer Bees While Dizo was a well-planned, successful hybrid, killer bees, on the other hand, the scientists originally intended to make something else. These ferocious and deadly creatures were accidentally produced by scientists who were trying to increase honey production by crossbreeding different bee species. 
European species of honeybees were introduced to South American ones, but due to hot conditions, the bees did not collect honey. To solve this problem, the scientists mixed an African bee gene with a European bee gene and developed a hybrid, a killer bee. And the name suits this creature so very well, as killer bees have been known to kill more than 400 people. Initially, everything was going great, but then scientists found out that the bee has developed strong defensive instincts, and they immediately attack an intruder near their hive. All the bees of the hive attack simultaneously over the intruder, and when I say that the attack is extremely painful and often fatal, you should believe me. Number 5. Leopon Another very rare and incredible hybrid of two big cats. Leopons are offspring of female lions and male leopards. This rare hybrid was produced as a result of fierce competition with other safari parks and zoos who were all getting more and more big cat hybrids. Leopons were first developed in Koshien Heisen Park in Nishiyama, Japan, where the family consisting of father leopard, mother lioness, and leopons as kids lived for more than 20 years. It was quite a leap and very impressive. The park raised the leopard and lioness together for them to attach with each other. And then, the first leopon cubs were born in 1959. Leopons love climbing and swimming, a trait they got from their father. The mother lioness frowns upon their swimming, but the father handles the situation quite well. They make a good family. Number 4. Kamas it's a hybrid not only between two different animals, but two different worlds. Kama is a hybrid between camels from Asia and llamas from South America. Both of them are very different from each other regarding their traits, but have a common ancestry. Via artificial insemination, the most successful breeding pair is of female llamas and male camels. The aim was to produce an animal with the size and strength of the camel, but a gullible temperament of a llama. Kamas are smaller than camels, have no hump like a camel, but are larger and stronger than llamas. Number 3. Blood Parrot Chiclet It's a hybrid made by crossing the Midas Chiclet and the Redhead Chiclet, but it's not a successful hybrid. The genetic mixture from both parents has left the fish with a combination of compromised physical traits, which makes it impossible for the fish to thrive. For example, its small mouth makes it difficult for the fish to feed itself properly, or sometimes have swimming problems, and is extremely docile. It is a pet fish, and despite the existential problems, their unusual appearance with round body, beak-like head, large eyes makes it very popular between fish pet lovers. It's a beautiful hybrid, sure, but still, some controversy surrounds it, and rightfully so. Creating a fish with deformities is unethical, and sometimes even cruel. Number 2. Puma Pard It is the offspring of a male puma and female leopard, or vice versa. They were first bred in the late 1890s and early 1900s in Germany by Karl Hagenbeck at his animal park in Hamburg. Most of the hybrids did not reach adulthood. Pumaparns are intermediate between the puma and leopard in color and pattern. They have faint leopard spots on a puma colored background. The length of a pumapard is much less than either parent, while the tail is long like a puma's. These hybrids were considered dull and uninteresting in the past. However, modern geneticists are more interested in them because the leopard and the puma are not very closely related enough to normally produce offspring. Number 1. Jag Lion Here comes my favorite hybrid, a cross between a jaguar and a lion. If you found some of our entries scary, then you should meet their boss in scariness. Hands down to the jag lion, the number one on our list. This powerful hybrid is the offspring of a male jaguar and a female lion. I couldn't find the marvelous brain responsible for this hybrid, but it was a wild, wild idea, and a brilliant one. The insemination of a female lion with a jaguar sperm results in either a brown or black beast that can scare the shit out of any man. An average diet of a jag lion is up to 20 pounds, where a normal lion eats only 8 pounds a day. They have stripes and spots on their bodies, and a healthy jag lion can weigh up to 600 pounds. 
In addition to that, jag lions can be fertile as well. Mate a jag lion with a leopard, and you will get a leo as well. Looks like this hybrid madness knows no boundaries. A piece of advice at the end, these dreadful beasts are the ones to keep their distance from. So if you ever come across a jag lion, pray that it's not hungry and that there's a wall or something between you and him. Thank you very much for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed it. Do like and share it with your friends and families. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos.